And you're outside the county administration building here. A big rally just wrapped up. Those here said this was a fight to save local businesses, save jobs, and keep the economy going. A big group of business owners and local leaders rallying outside the county administration building with County Supervisor Jim Desmond leading the charge to keep businesses open just days after the county slid back into the more restrictive purple tier. Cases have been going up, but there really has been no correlation to the restaurants or to churches or to the gyms and the museums that are having to shut down all of their indoor activities. So. That lack of correlation and I think primarily also the fact that the, the state keeps changing the rules and there's been a lot of frustration on people's part. Many here with signs and messages of keep San Diego open and say no to lockdowns. These folks say that there has to be a way to keep people healthy and keep businesses going. They say these continuing shutdowns will have a devastating effect on the local economy. Some business owners have already made tough decisions over the past few days. Phil Pace, owner of Phil's Barbecue, just shut down his San Marcos location for good after 10 years. It's a shame. It's a real shame that we can't get things worked out to the point where we can at least, the majority of them can maintain. But with that happening, it's going to be a lot of employees out of work, be a lot of restaurants closing down, and it's just going to add 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 more to uh, the unemployment just got to the point where you know those numbers just didn't add up anymore karen barnett owner of small bar in university heights decided to close for good after 11 years she says the purple tier didn't do it just a lousy 2020. i'm very disappointed that the government hasn't found a way in these last eight months to figure out how to freeze our rents freeze mortgages and help businesses because you know we're all just losing our businesses are having to make really hard choices. Meanwhile, Supervisor Desmond is fighting for the county, having more of a say about how it reopens. Right now, one of the places where people are testing positive the most is in their own homes, in their households. People are having backyard parties or they're having barbecues or having people over. And that a lot of the uh, virus is spreading through those activities. And we're actually pushing more people towards that by closing down businesses.